This is Poor Richard's Books, and we're in the capital city of Kentucky, which is Frankfurt, not Louisville or Lexington. And uh, we have been in business for 33 years, which is pretty outstanding for a small bookstore. We have, I think, been a, a community center. We do readings, we've had music here, we do uh, community, just exchange community in information. So I think we're kind of the hub of downtown and the hub of Frankfurt, in fact. Uh, we're right across from the old Capitol building, um, so we have lots of tourists coming through, visitors that need to go to our Capitol government offices. So uh, we have lots of folks of all different types coming through downtown. Are there any particular kind of books that people who live here in the Frankfurt area that they kind of flock to? Is it more history books, political books? What, what are people reading around here? Well, this is a political town, so we have quite a few people reading political books. And, and Lincoln, being uh, you know born in Kentucky, we, we sell a lot of, of Lincoln material. But we also have a, a, a little press that's done historic images of old Frankfurt. And those books have been really successful. People are reading differently nowadays. What is Poor Richard's going to keep up with that? Well, people are reading differently, but people are still reading. And, um, and I think that there's a, a big difference in the way uh, that things are going to end up. But I don't think we're there yet. So there's some resistance to, to the new electronic readers, uh, especially in, in this area uh, where the thing, people are just a little bit older, uh, so they're, and they don't travel as much. If I was in the metro area, I'd be on the, on the metro line with my Kindle too. But um, right now, it's still kind of, everybody's trying to figure out how it's gonna go. Um, authors are excited when their books come out in ebook form. That's great because people are going to read them, but hopefully they'll give them as a gift too, in a real book form. How has business been with the with the changing economy? Well, <laughs> this is where Mark Twain said, "If I die, I want to die in Kentucky because everything happens 20 years later." Well, the, things happened a little bit later. There was a ripple, um, and so the first couple of years of the depression here have not been too bad and then state government started faltering uh, and that's that's kind of uh, hit a bit harder but everybody's hopeful and the bigger picture out there is looking better so um, you know with the chains closing the big box stores we're hoping some of that trickles our way too I started this when I was like 27 years old so yeah, so um, we've been at it for quite some time here, 33 years, um, and and I'm you know it's still exciting every day opening the boxes and pulling the books out. It's just like having Christmas every day of the year.